Hi, I'm Rich from New Life Scientific. Today we are showing the Corning Epic system. The system was removed from a very reputable pharmaceutical facility and professionally decommissioned by an engineer directly from Corning. Um, one nice thing about this system, um, the engineer was able to get all the calibration files off of the computer before they destroyed it. Um, so it will not include the computer or software. However, we have been in communication with the engineer that did decommission this, and he is definitely very familiar with the system. Um, he has the calibration files. He knows what it takes to get this unit up and running again. Um, we do got the quotes for this, and along with the quotes also for upgrading the system. Um, it was originally set up for a 384 plate, but now with new software development, he is now utilizing the 1536 well plate and even for higher outputs. So this is a nice, nice system. Um, we do got the power supply out on the end where normally it would sit in under the unit, but I just wanted to do that for this video. Now we're going to just take a little stroll around this system. Uh, one thing you'll notice right away, this actually has a liquid handler on it. As you can see, um, a lot of the systems out there don't have the, the liquid handling system. Uh, this was just pretty much had all the options with it. Um, they didn't sp spare any expense when they built this unit for sure, but everything is just pristine condition. Um, like I said, it was professionally removed from the facility. Um, down here you can see the power supply, got the cords and a few different pieces, um, trim pieces and different things but normally the power supply would just slide right inside of this cavity so that it's just concealed without um, being able to see it. Um, you can see the power supply here, but like I said, just a real pristine condition. I'm gonna come around the back here. Um, again, you can see the liquid handling option here. And just really nice. Um, here you have the, also the manual, user's manual, and then also you have the calibration plate here too. And actually we got the part of the engineer here that uh, you can contact for all the more information on this unit. Um, we're going to open up and look at the inside of this. And right away you can see the incubation area back here. It's got a plexiglass door here yet. Um, here you can see the hotel, hotel tower in here um, where it has a robotic feeder that takes a plate down and then brings it down to the reader down at the bottom here. You can see it still has all the zip ties here from keeping anything from moving. That was all, like I said, installed by the engineer when they decommissioned it. But the inside of this is just very pristine. It shows very little use but it's definitely a nice system. If you need any information, just feel free to call us here at New Life Scientific. We can get you more information. Like I said, the technician is available also for any questions you have. Again, this is Rich from New Life Scientific, and thank you for watching.